Greetings and welcome. This is Shuri from Spiritual Magic Journey and this is your monthly tarot card reading predictions for our lovely Cancers for the month of January 2024. So, Happy New Year everyone. I hope you are having a beautiful, wonderful, and blessed, blessed month. Happy and safe New Year's. We're in a brand new month and a brand new year. So... We're going to see what's coming through for our lovely Cancers for this month. Before we get started, let me say thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Um, I appreciate it if you're new. Um, share, like, and um, make sure you hit the notification bell so you can keep up to date. It really helps me and I appreciate each and every one of you. And this month, we're going to get you a kind of like an overview bing card. Uh, uh, it's not a postcard, but it's a, a spirit messages deck. Get a message from here. A couple of cards from the Witch's Tarot and a couple of cards from uh, Sacred Traveler to see what is happening with our lovely Cancer. So let's ring our bell. And let's jump right on in. And before I get started, go look at your 2024 predictions. If you haven't, that video is up on YouTube. Asking my team to step forward, assist me with this reading. So what this counts to me to hear and know. The month of January, angels. You know what? I don't. I think this is going to be an easier year for people to write 2024. You know how you forget what year and you keep writing the old year back, but I think people want 2020 year just to go on. <laughs> this is really going to be easy for us to write 2024. We we're not going to forget we're in 2024. It's like yes, a new year. So your 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 message from the spirit messages deck is take a moment, stop. Now is not the time to rush into the decision you're about to make. Before uh, this important decision is made, take a moment to pause and quiet your mind so that you can ask your soul for guidance before you act or move forward. So if you're making any important decisions this month, take a minute and ask for guidance. It's okay. I sure, um, or if you need guidance, if you just need guidance from your spiritual team, take a moment and ask, listen, then listen and wait and feel what you're, you're feeling and look for the synchronicities and signs and you may get your answer on a billboard, you may get your answer in a, a meme on Facebook or a video or a song comes on. So pay attention. So what else does cancer? Look, one of the lovely cancers this month in January. Look at the butterflies. You're going through a transformation. You're blossoming. Something new is emerging. You're coming out of your cocoon and you're moving forward. But there is a but there. <laughs> but this brand new new beginning, it seems like it's going to be on pause. But it's not going to be on pause for long because you've got the magician. Remember, you hold the power. Remember the Wizard of Oz? You hold, always hold the power. You always have held the power. We're the ones that hold power here on this planet. Really. If you really want to truly know. But you're blossoming. You're transforming. There's a brand new beginning. It's a brand new beginning in a new city. A new home. Starting your own business. Uh, changing jobs. Uh, uh, a new relationship but there's something that's going to come in that you're going to 
it's going to be on the little paws, but that little paws is going to bring about more enlightenment, and then you can move forward. You find a way around that, because you are the magician. You find a way around that. It's like the universe is giving you all the tools that you need to be successful, and they're there. So you take a, a pause out, or something happens where you have to stop what you're doing for not long, and you um, find a way to start moving forward again. It says, view from above, get the big picture, navigating the stars, follow your bliss, so don't give up. Ascending the mountain, keep going forward, so do not give up, keep moving forward. Because it's almost feel like this new, brand new thing that's coming in stops for a little bit. Whatever it is in your life. It stops for a little bit. And you have to regather your thoughts or regather some information or something that you have to get. That you become more enlightened. It's like you've got more knowledge now. You've gathered more information now. Now you can move forward. And that's what you do. You are the magician in this. You are the magician. And that's going to bring about your success is remembering who you are. That you are hold the power you always held the power and it's telling you do not give up navigating by the stars follow your bliss and this is what you're going to be doing is following your bliss and you're going to have to get the view from above meaning get the big picture this hangman is what's going to bring in the big picture for you this month in january it's going to bring in the big picture you're going to see the big picture yeah, you're going to have to pause to see it before you make any decisions. Call on your team. Get advice from family, friends, or uh, an advisor if that comes into play for you. But new opportunities are there. And don't give up. Keep going. It's going to be ascending the mountain. It may be feel like it's a hard journey but trust me success is there success is there if you don't give up and keep moving forward this is like straight to the point <laughs> straight to the point here they're saying straight to the point uh yeah i feel like this when you come out of this you, it's like you're you're being in the cocoon and you're blossoming and growing and coming out of it and you got all these new ideals coming uh could be some opportunities that's coming in but what you're going to have to do is follow your bliss on this one follow your bliss is what they're saying so absolutely uh, to me it's a straightforward reading straightforward keep moving forward even though there may be a setback or temporary setback, it's not going to last long. Remember, you hold the power. You see the infinity sign there, the number eight. This is a number eight year um, connected with um, as above, so below. It's already been written in the heavens, and now you're about to manifest and create it because you are the magician. You're about to manifest and create it here on earth in your reality. Yeah. All right, guys. That's all I want to say. Straightforward reading. I'm going to let this be the end. So blessings. Namaste.